hello wonderful people how are you today hope you had a wonderful time well today we're making fried beans and the ingredients you need they are your beans i'm using those you can use any type of beans you have any color the brown the bigger white ones but this is the one i have in the house so i'm using this then we have scent leaf scent leaf I have onion as much as you like I have ripe and thin rather I'll be using two you can use as many as you want depending on your taste if uh, the person that likes sweet things can use I'll be using my fish I'll be using my crayfish inside you have my tomato and my pepper then I'll be using palm oil, I'll be using salt obviously, and stock cube, any stock cube you have. So I'm going to prep all this and I'll show you when we come back. Okay, welcome back. I'm done prepping my fish, the onion, the plantain, and my scent leaf, and my my tomato pepper and crayfish so so let's see if the water is boiling all right so I'm going to add my beans in it now this is the way I like to cook some persons wash before they cook I like to parboil then wash most times because the beans have been preserved for a long time so it won't stay long immediately it starts boiling I'll get it off the fire and wash it off so let's check on our beans all right so it's boiling so we're going to get it down and wash it so I've poured it out so this is basically what you just have to do you don't need to like scrub or anything so you don't get the um, the shells off so this is just what you just need to do so this is just what you need to do just all so I'll finish the process and we'll get to the nest <clears throat> so I'm done washing now you can see the water is just hot so you don't need to let it boil this time around so I'm going to add the beans into it and I have enough water okay because these beans would actually soak up all the water you can see here so it needs to get soft so we're going to leave it to cook for 30 20 minutes depending on the base all you have to do is you come intervals to check on it give it a stir and we're done you just let it cook on its own please no don't add anything no salt no stock cube no nothing nothing for now just the water and the beans because most times when you add salt the beans would not get soft okay so we want the beans to be very soft so that's all we need for now just let it close the pot and let it boil so let's check on our beans after a few minutes wow it's boiling beautifully okay so we still need another 20 minutes or thereabouts depending on the pressure of um, the fire you're cooking with so okay let's see ya. wow all right so you can see the water is almost gone so it's now time to go to the next phase you can see it's almost soft 
or still have a lot of water inside so we're going to quickly fry it so it's going to get um, cooked at the same time so i have my empty pot So not too much, just enough. And we are not going to let the oil bleach so much. I'm adding my quickly so I've added my my tomato pepper and onion and my crayfish so the next thing I'm going to add is my fish so I'm adding my fish into it Now I'm going to add my salt. Remember there was no salt in the beans. But that doesn't mean you should add so much salt. You just have to taste it to know if you're going to add little or not. Adding my stock cube. Give it a quick stir. Let it cook for a few minutes. Then we'll add the other ones we're back let's check oh okay just the way you want it and now it's time to put in our beans we're adding our beans into it again Give it a beautiful stir. Now I'm going to be adding my plantain. And you stir. Hmm. please share this video share like the page and subscribe okay please that's the only way to grow this channel and also motivate me to do more please subscribe very important and you can see our beans it's boiling so we need the water in it now to go down so we're going to cover and let it cook okay it's boiling okay so we'll have to reduce reduce the heat so it would not boil Intervals is there. Excuse me. You can see the beans, it's looking good.
looking all nice and see the water too the water is going down so at this point if you like it watery you can leave it like this just put off the light but if you don't like it watery you like it a little bit um, thick you still leave it for a while I like it a little bit thick so I'm going to leave it even if you even if it's watery by the time it cools down it becomes thick so and that is it that's all what you need and our food is done so you can see it's sticking up it's no longer watering <laughs> i know you're imagining it was the head of fish oh please this head of fish is very important to me very important <laughs> i love head of fish okay don't worry <laughs> my people in the house know all right so time to get it off the fire and we're done thank you for watching